Hi guys, it's me, oh my god, Wolf Light. Welcome back. Do I have a free bottle? No, I don't. Huh? I think I'm gonna head down to Farallon to collect some supplies and to do other things. Need to upgrade this. A monster clown or a mental skull. I'm gonna have to head down anyway. I'll go pick up. You know what? I'm gonna head down now. We can speak to the old woman while we're at it and we can collect some ingredients. Most of those I can get in Peron anyway. I want my iron shield back though. I'll hold on to anything of yours you want me to. Oh, yes, please. Wonder also, what do you have? Good. Bye. Did I already upgrade this? I need lots of tumbleweed and lots of monster claws. Uh. 
Yeah, I want to head down with this instead. I love this part. It's my favorite scene. Groovy <laughs> <Cruise> it! <laughs> Let go! <laughs> I love that part like space. <laughs> oh, rock landing. Yeah, no thanks to you. I think I might have broke some hay legs here, so did anyone ever teach you how to land without crash? Small birds. Whoa. Whoa! B birds Tell me birds! Whoa! Oh, hey! Welcome to the service, girls! And this is Gorka. And what is that name? Oh, go on, Goose! What? How? What? 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 The surface, Goose. Later, known as I roll. What's going on here? Ever since Zelda Vance, you've been zipping in and out of town all in a hurry. So I forgot to tell you, and you might leave me to Zelda. This is so wild. Seriously, what is it? I think over there. <laughs> and what's with all these trees? There are so many! <laughs> Where are we? Just come to me straight! I can take it! Where are we? It's out of here! <laughs> On a side note, the Goron's always looking for people from Skyloft. You think he would have noticed Cruz? What's the deal with this place? If there's supposed to be nothing below the clouds, what's all this? There is stuff down here. Now, I'll get your hands off and I'll explain everything. You see, Zelda fell and then this happened and this. Uh, whoa. You're kind of imploding my mind right now. Dude, seriously. But I think I get what you're saying. If I... If I've got this right, Zelda's down here somewhere and she's okay? Yes. But there's a demon lord after her. She's she's okay. Oh, wow, that's so great. <laughs> Don't you dare cry on me here. Here, that is such a huge weight off my mind. You know, Link, it's sort of all right down here. Don't you dare. This place needs a name. Yeah, I ain't fitting for this rugged, adventurous wilderness. From now on, we'll call it Gooseland! Uh, how about no? How about high roll? I like that name better. What? Gooseland? Are you serious? So let me see if I got this right. The old lady living in the temple down the road from here knows where Zelda is. I see, right? Link, thanks for getting me here. You've done a good job. You, you can head on big routes to the search for Zelda from here. 
Y'all both track her down, save her, and then give her a lift back to Skyla. <coughs> How are you planning to get out? Only I can use those statues, apparently. Because I have the cloth. You need the sail cloth. I'll track her down, save her, and then give her a lift back to Skyla. <laughs> then when we get back, Oscar, if she wants to make our whole going out thing official, and then the two of us will get some quality time together and... Uh, keep dreaming. Anyway, the point is, your work here is done, and I gotta cover from here. Yeah, no. Now, it's not to find the old lady you were talking about. Catch you later, Link! Uh, he's gonna get himself in trouble, isn't he? Hello, buddies! Ah! I was. Hello! Hey! Oh, hey, Bella, we meet again in a hurry as usual, hey? Yeah, but I've been keeping busy too, checking out the wonders of the world. Say, so, you wanna hear about some of my research? Uh, sure. Oh. Okay, but prepare to be amazed. I made a huge discovery while I was out doing my field research. So, get a look at this. Apparently, there are walls and statues that respond to beautiful tones. Wild, right? Wanna know more? Of course. Mm -hmm. Alright! This is the kind of archaeological museum I like to see. Oh, but before we get into the details of wall statues, there's something that I better ask you about, bud. You ever heard of a blessed butterfly? Yeah, I've seen one. All right, bud, but then let me jump straight to the point. Mm -hmm. I should tell us about these butterflies flapping around packs by certain walls and statues. Seems like these butterflies have some kind of sixth sense. They're detecting off something. Want to hear more? Which are you interested in? Walls! Hey. From what I've learned, it sounds like these walls were left behind by the ghosts for the hero mentioned in the legends. Oh, thank you. The themes the hero desires is that the spring forth from behind the walls. That's why they call them ghost walls, I suppose. Hungry dear more? Uh, of course. Ooh. That is the spirit! But sadly, that, that is far as my research go, has gotten me. So that making you discover you'll be the first to know. What about statues? Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, no. Well, that was too bad. Well, if you ever get the research, you come in. You know where to find me. Mm -hmm. Uh, statues. Hey! The writings claim that those statues appear out of nowhere with a boing sound and speak a strange language. Can you believe everybody talking statues? I know you want to hear more. Tell me more. I think I've seen it. That is the spirit besides that as far as my research has gotten me. That's nice. That's nice. I better go catch up with Groose before he embarrasses me. Great, I'm babysitting him now. Wonderful. I love that cutscene so much. <laughs> Link's face on it is just hilarious. Girls, don't get me in trouble. <laughs> oh, you gotta be kidding me, Granny. <laughs> You're messing with me. Say it again. I dare you. I always speak the truth. You're not the one who will save her. The spirit maiden, your Zelda, can only be saved by another. It has been his fate to do that. Staying in and doing so saves us. As it was decided long before you were brought crying into this world. <laughs> Shut up, Granny! You actually don't know me well, cause... Why am I doing that voice? Cause if you did, you know that if anyone's gonna save Zelda, it's Groose. How could it be? How could it not be me? If it ain't me, why would I even be in here if I'm not up to the job being the hero just who is? Uh, huh? Hello, I'm Mr. Hero she's talking about. Oh, now I get ya. Link Granny here has been trying to tell me you're gonna be the big hero rescue Zelda. You have no idea what I've been going through down here, do you, Goose? Like I say, you fight this crap! <laughs> what a chocolate! All I've heard so far is a bug about leaning about that scene, but that's a load of garbage. I know you, and you're no hero, shrimp. You don't know me very well then, gross. You haven't seen what I've been up to down here. 
Wow! Poor girls. Here in Slink, were you able to catch up with Zelda? Ah, I see, so the Guardian was there as well, was she? The one you saw was Zelda is known as Impa. She is a being sent forth by the goddess to aid Zelda in her quest. Well, I guess I spotted it in an episode too soon, whoops! The two have traveled somewhere in order to accomplish a great task. Destiny has set before them. However, now that Impa has destroyed the gate that they use, there is only one way left to find them. You must make use of the harp given to you by Zelda. Oh yeah, she gave me a harp. Tell me, Link, have you identified that harp you received? My sense is that you have not yet familiarized yourself with it. Very well, I shall teach you how to play it. Listen well and do as I say. First press. Turn your heart up. First it. Okay. Okay, good. Now for your next lesson. Focus on playing time with the pulsing in the circle of light. When your time is ready, I shall join my voice to your heart. <clears throat> Listen well, for the song I sing will I will be a great help to you in your journey. Earth and sky, bring light to the land, hero of the goddess. You yeah, learned about of the goddess. It's a mysterious melody that has been passed down from ancient times. Pretty. The harp you hold is known as the Goddess's Harp. It is a divine instrument of the Goddess who once watched over this land. Ooh. The melodies it brings to life have the power to produce a variety of strange and otherworldly effects. The great slab standing before you is known as the Gate of Time. It is the last of its kind in existence, the only portal binding our world to the one where Zelda now resides. If you manage to open the gate and pass through, you will likely end up in the same place as Zelda. You'll need to endure many hardships and put yourself in great danger to awaken the gate from its dormant state. Though your journey will put you in harm's way, Link, you must endure it. It is your fate as the chosen hero of the god to it. <laughs> what the? The shake I fear the seal has been broken! I expected I would react to your summoning game by never mouse and seal would break so quickly. Link, there will be time to explain right now. You must hurry to the bottom of the pit outside. Alright, I'll go. Shall I find more time to talk later for now? You must go. Alright, uh. Let's have Slingshot a quick just in case. Huh? <laughs> 